Okay, everyone, I am going to do something that I usually don't do. I never film me cooking, but today I am making apple pie egg rolls. So I am starting off by dicing up fresh apples. I put some country crock plant butter with olive oil in there. I did about two tablespoons and now I'm going to add some nutmeg. I'm not exactly sure how much I'm going to put on here, but just enough. Okay, I'm going to try and show you as I'm doing this. I also have some cinnamon. I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of that. Excuse me if I'm distracted with my view here and I also have some pumpkin pumpkin pie spice but it's so similar to what you would use to season potatoes sweet potatoes or apples so I'm going to add a little bit of that as well just for a little extra notes of flavor and to that, I'm going to add a few drops of pure vanilla extract. So give me one second while I... I'm sorry if I'm... I'm trying to do this with one hand, guys. So I'm just going to do a couple of, couple of drops. Okay, that was just a few drops of the pure vanilla extract. I don't know if you can hear that sizzling. It's starting to make some sizzle sounds. So, okay. Now I am going to also, now that that's going, I'm going to hold on one second because I'm going to grab some flour. Hold on. Okay, I'm back and now I'm going to add some King Arthur all-purpose flour. And I have about a tablespoon and a half. I'm just going to sprinkle that in as well. And I have a fresh lemon but I'm going to squeeze a little bit of this uh oh I think I got a seed in there oh well I'm just going to put a little lemon juice in there I would say that's about a teaspoon and I'm just going to start combining all of that together guys and cook that down yeah Oh, now, besides this, I'm sorry, we're going to also add our sugars. So let me cut the fire down a little bit as well. I'll be right back with the sugar. Okay, so I'm going to also add some light brown sugar. And I don't have um, organic, unbleached sugar. Um, I usually do sugar in the raw, but I, I'm going to use some agave in the raw. And I'm going to be a little generous with how much I'm putting in there, as you can see. And I'm going to also add some brown sugar. Pause. I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, here's the brown sugar I'm putting in. I hope that's enough. I think I better do just a little bit more. Okay. And again, I'm going to just combine all of that. I'm sorry. It's hard to do this, guys. I need to uh, practice, but I wanted to at least come on and film this. So this is going to cook down. I'm going to allow this to cook down till those apples are not 
firm and anymore till they cook down some. I'm gonna cut the heat up just a touch. But yeah, so that's what the mixture looks like so far. It's gonna probably caramelize even more, more as it cooks down and then I'll be back. Okay, I know what I did forget to show you guys is that we're gonna put a little bit of salt in here as well so i'm going to put a little bit of um salt and i'm going to put a little bit of himalayan pink salt but it i have a grinder and it's going to make it into a very um um what's the word i want to use not coarse but fine a very fine grit of uh himalayan pink salt Okay, guys, next I have some vegan egg roll wraps. And these are what we're going to wrap the apples in to create our apple pie egg rolls. 